sparkly rosy peach water, peach yogurt shake, and a peach tea with a floating cream. In this video, I'm going to show you three peach drinks that represent totally different profiles. Before getting to the drinks, I'm going to make rosy peach water and a simple peach jam as preparation. To start off, choose four big sized peaches, about one kilo in total. The peaches should be ripe but not overripe. Wash the peaches thoroughly using vegetable and fruit cleanser if possible. Then peel and save the skin, which is a key ingredient for making the peach water later. Cut a peach around to separate the seed, then cut flesh off the seed as much as possible. See how dark pink the seed is for this kind of peach? Don't throw it away. Add it to the skin, as this is the secret to make the most beautiful rosy peach water. For the flesh, roughly cut into cubes. For this size of peaches, you will get roughly about 750 grams of flesh. Divide the flesh into 300 grams and 230 grams. One to be frozen and one to be chilled, which takes time, so put them in the refrigerator right away. And the remaining flesh will be used for the peach jam. But first, let's make rosy peach water as the chilling takes time, so make sure to do this step first. In a saucepan with a peach skin and the seeds, add 650 ml of water. Turn the heat on to medium high and bring the water to a boil. Then lower the heat to small medium and keep simmering till the color of the seeds becomes pale and the pink patches and spots on the skin also fade. The whole process would take about 10 minutes. Then turn off the heat and leave the skin and seeds in the water to infuse for 15 to 20 minutes. After that, drain the seeds and skin, use a back spoon to squeeze the water out as much as possible. And that's the peach water. See how rosy and beautiful it is. Put it in the refrigerator to chill completely. Now the jam. In a saucepan, add 200 grams of flesh, along with 90 grams of cashew sugar and one tablespoon of lemon juice. Turn the heat on to medium high. Stir constantly in the beginning till all the sugar bits melt. Then stop stirring. Heat it to a boil and then turn the heat down to medium low. Stir once in a while to prevent the bottom from burning. It took me about 12 minutes till the temperature reaches 104 degrees Celsius or 219 degrees Fahrenheit. At this point, turn the heat off and allow the jam to cool a bit on the counter. Then add it to blender and process into paste. And that's the peach jam. At this point, the jam still looks quite liquid, but it will thicken when chilled. Besides these two, you'll also need some sparkling water chilled, a large banana frozen, and some chilled plain yogurt. Now that the preparation is done, making the drinks will be astonishingly easy. The easiest is the sparkling rosy peach water. In a jar, mine is a shy away from two cups. First, add one tablespoon of chilled peach jam and spread it evenly at the bottom. Then add 180 ml of chilled peach water and top with 200 ml of sparkling water. And that's it. Mix well before drinking. This drink will add a refreshing peachy flavor to the plain carbonated water. The next is a peach yogurt shake. In the blender, add 300 grams of frozen peach cubes, along with 150 grams of frozen banana, 150 grams of plain yogurt, as well as one teaspoon of peach jam. Blend everything together to a very smooth shake. This recipe yields about three cups. And you may end up with yearning for more of this peachy, creamy, and healthy drink. The last one is a peach tea with floating cream. This is a relatively healthier version. First off in a bowl, add 130 grams of whipping cream, 60 grams of plain yogurt, and one teaspoon of the peach jam. Use a whisk to beat till it reaches right before the soft peak stage which is the mixture of thickens, part of which can cling on the whisk, while some can still drizzle down back into the bowl. Then cover and put it in the refrigerator to chill. Next, in the blender, add 230 grams of chilled peach cubes, 150 ml of chilled peach water, and one teaspoon of the peach jam. Blend for a few seconds or till it just becomes smooth. Now here, you can replace the peach water with chrysanthemum tea or some black tea, but I decided I like the peach water the best. Fill the jar about 70% full, then carefully spoon the cream mixture on top. The most common variation for tea shops is to replace the yogurt with cream cheese, but I had to cut a set rate of fat for a homemade version. And there you go, the three peach drinks for summer. Enjoy!